So a couple of people might have been surprised by my transgender pin that I put on this morning. This is not good, this is not good. I figured it's about time that I came out and talked about my gender identity. Hmm. I am trigender, which means like a triangle, I have three genders. Wow. Male, female, and non-binary. And the difference between trigender and gender fluid is that I feel all three of these genders at the same time. I have one eye and I saw that a mile away, but okay. Okay. <laughs> all the time. It doesn't ever shift or change or where I feel one gender more strongly than the other, like gender fluid tends to be. Also, I should recognize and accept that a lot of people don't see non-binary as a third gender. They see it as something completely separate from the binary. Uh, I can be nice, but you kind of make the game a little confusing for me because it seems you can switch whenever you want and you can then force me to speak in a way and if I make a mistake, <laughs> I feel very attacked. I don't want to be your friend of male and female, um, but for me, it's like a third gender. Or I guess you could call it a third identity. <laughs> so how I feel gender-wise is like a man, like a woman, and as neither at the same time. Mm. I hope this clears things up, but let no! me know if you have any more questions no! I'm happy to answer. <laughs> So as you can see people, we're starting a little strong today. I'm just going to watch a few more of these transgender videos that are popping up on Twitter. And it's not that people don't want to support people that are transgender sometimes. You want to be including, inclusive, but it seems that the more we empathize with you, the more you believe, hey, if I manage to do this, I guess I can get more. That's how it feels. It feels like transgender people in these clips that I'm going to show you, they're kind of capitalist. Now let's set aside the word and the idea. Now let's set aside the word and the idea of preference. Okay. We can debate whether or not it's a preference or a complete rejection, but when you've had men tell you that they want to date you, mm -hmm. but they're afraid to, mm -hmm. that doesn't really feel like a preference to me. And yes, Good point. I'm talking from experience. Yes, we can. Now, preference is wanting Evian bottled water over Dasani. But if you were thirsty, you would drink either one. Please, for the love of God, don't tell me you would refuse either one of those two over the other because my faith in humanity is hanging on by a thread here. So, my TikTok, my rules. You cannot use the word preference anywhere in the comments. If you do, I will know you haven't watched this whole thing and I will only respond with this random sponge emoji and you will be forever cursed as to why that is. Also, I encourage others to do the same. So happy commenting everyone. Well, I guess you can call me SpongeBob. <laughs> Surprise, mother! Oh my God! I didn't even spit. I guess I should be happy. I'm a sponge. Too. <laughs> Woo! I need to calm down. <laughs> I wasn't even prepared for my own joke. Life is so good when you can just laugh at yourself sometimes. I mean, he did make a good point about the preference thing. But I do think people in prison also think the same way when they can't find any woman. Do you understand what I'm saying? So, not that I'm saying that you're that type of a person. All I'm saying, it's not all about preference. It's about I want to have somebody that I can have a proper future with. And statistically, that, don't, that doesn't work. You're not the most stable. You can't have babies. And even if you could adopt a baby, I don't think you really want a baby with a man. So, you kind of shoot yourself in the legs the longer we keep thinking about this. Maybe. Oh no, the transphobia in my comment section needs to stop. Yesterday I posted a TikTok responding to this question. What are the red flags you look for in men? And one of them was if he wouldn't date a trans woman. Red flag. And my comment section? If he won't date a trans woman, so you only date gay men? Understood. What's wrong with not wanting to date a trans woman? It's his choice. Oh, that's a problem? Totally, except for trans woman. I don't think even a very woke man to necessarily be comfortable with a trans person as a partner. Actually, 
All actually valid except 13. Literally many trans women are okay that some guys don't like them. Maybe you should be too. <laughs> so I agreed on everything except for the trans. You can respect, be friendly, be kind. That doesn't mean you are transphobic if you don't date trans data trends you get the idea i can't put them all because there's too many let me break this down trans women are women mm. so if you're heterosexual and you're a man and you said you wouldn't date a trans woman because it's a preference that's just transphobia period mm. the majority of the time our preferences are rooted in something problematic it mm. could be trauma mm. racism mm. transphobia mm. the list goes on mm. if you want to find out what your problematic preferences are click the link in my bio and watch this video okay. i am now going to take you all through an example this person asked why it's transphobic to not want to date a trans woman. Already starting off on the wrong foot by referring to cis women as regular women. Okay. Then said something about trans women not being able to carry children. If that's your sole reason for dating someone, keep that same energy for all the women who are infertile. Get it! Well, with your last logic, yes, men have left women that cannot have a baby. Disgusting! They don't want to go to the process of adopting a baby. Sometimes they don't love them that much. Sometimes they want something that looks like them. So you're telling me that somebody should be able to buy something that kind of feels like they have a baby of their own, which is not their own. Just like you bought certain things for your body that is not your own, but you feel something. You're pushing your ideology on them, hoping they agree with your ideology. They don't. So the fact that you do that, that's dictatorship. Are you freaking kidding me? What? I will give you and you have to be happy. Or we don't agree and you might go to prison. 